Welcome to the Home Depot, where we're picking out material for a wood faux beam. We grabbed a 1x10 for the bottom and 1x6s for the sides, but obviously grab whatever sizes will fit your space best. Now here we are ripping a 45 degree angle down both edges of the 1x10, and you only need to rip a 45 down one edge of the 1x6s where it'll meet the bottom. You can go ahead and sand down to get rid of any frays or sharp edges, and then test to see if it fits well. We then added in some vertical blocking to really beef up the rigidity and give the side pieces something to attach to aside from the corner joints. And as you can see here, some of my corner joints are trash, but nothing a little sanding, filler, and more sand you can't fix. No one will ever know, except everybody watching this. Now for install. We attached 2x4 blocking to the ceiling, size to fit snugly inside of the beam. And then we shot in some finish nails to temporarily hold it in place until properly screwing. Next up is the stain. 